Sorry to interrupt, editing Shafe in the future here. I just wanted to remind you guys about this giveaway that I have currently going on. It ends February 22nd. On the screen, you can see the two prizes that are being offered to two lucky winners. So if you are interested in entering this giveaway, look for this post on my Instagram page and follow the instructions to enter. Now let's get back to the video. Hey squad, welcome back or welcome to my channel. For those of you that are new here, my name is Shay and I am the owner behind Hair by Shay. I sell a variety of hair care products that help you to get the healthy growing hair that you desire and as well as providing a variety of hair services such as customized wigs, clip-in hair extensions, I wash and style wigs, pretty much anything you could think of. Hair, I do it, I love it. So if you're interested in following any of my socials, they will be in the caption below and I will put them on the screen. Editing Shay, remember to do that. Okay, so in today's video, we are doing a Q&A, get to know me, also mukbang style, I guess. Um, I haven't eaten yet. So um, there will be two parts to this. I will be, the first part will be doing a YouTuber, get to know me type question tag. And then the second part, a few weeks back, I asked you guys um, to ask me any questions you had for me. So I'll be going through those questions and answering them. So if you're interested in this type of video, getting to know me, getting to know the person behind Hair by Shay, continue watching and grab yourself a drink and a snack and let's get right into the video. Okay, so I have my food here. Ooh, before we start, if you like this type of content, if you like I know my vibe, whatever it is, be sure to like and comment beneath this video. It helps with the algorithm, tells YouTube that I, you guys like this type of video, and it tells me that you guys like this type of video. And be sure to subscribe because I will be coming out with lots of videos. All right, so let's see what we have here. So I got Wendy's, of course. Um, I got chili with fries. I got Dave's double combo. With this, oh, I forgot there was ice cream in here. This has been sitting here for like while I get ready. Um, and I got medium fries. Okay, we're gonna get it out. Oh, I forgot about the ice cream. Let's show you. Oh my, I think this is the frosty. Okay, that's the frosty. It's okay, it's okay. Um, fun random fact about me I, oh, that's gross. My table is very clean, other than the spot I just made. Oh, you're cold. I'm just gonna zap you in the fridge, the microwave, and I'll be right back. All right, so we are back. Got myself some napkins, got myself all set up. All right, so. Did this air graze? Bless this food, amen. So, I already said what we have. I'm gonna take a quick bite. Mmm. Mm -mm -mm. Not me eating and not getting to the questions. Disclaimer if you don't like eating, not the video for you. So let's get into these questions. All right, so let's get into the get to know me like YouTuber tag. Let's try some chili. So first question on the YouTuber tag, like get to know me, what is your full name? So I'll give you guys my first name and my two middle names. And I have three last names by technicality, but I won't share those just for privacy security reasons, I guess. Yummy. I love one use chili. But my first name is Ashina. That's my full name. If you are a friend or family member, you probably call me Shay. And I consider you guys friends and family, so that's what we go with. Um, well, a lot of my family members, like my mom, sister my brothers um like I guess immediate family they might call me Shayna but yeah we go by Shay um and then I have two middle names Brittany and Danielle 
Um, most commonly, I go by Ashina Danielle. A lot of people actually thought that was my last name, but that's actually my middle name. How old are you? I am... I'm sorry I could be playing with my hair. I'm trying to fix it, you know? But how old I am? I am 26 years old. Mm -mm. I don't know if I look 26 years old. Yeah, I'm 26. Born 1994. My birthday's this year. Um, well, of course my birthday's this year, but my 27th birthday is this year, I guess. In the summertime. August. I'm a August baby. Speaking of August baby, yes, the next question is, what is your zodiac sign? So my zodiac sign is a Leo. I'm born August 15th. So shout out to all my Leos. Best sign to ever do it. <laughs> what is your height? I like to say that I'm 5'2". I believe I'm 5'2". I'm pretty really sure my doctor told me I was 5'2". But some people will be like, no, you're not. You're 5'1". So between there, 5'1", 5'2". Drinking ginger ale because I forgot to order a drink. Where are you from? Where do you live? Um, I am from Canada. <laughs> I was born in Canada. Um, currently living in Toronto. Let's just see here. Hmm. We're talking in terms of background. Both of my parents were born and raised in Jamaica. And then there's like some mix in there. Where do you go to college? Well. I go to, I'm currently in university. Um, I go to York University for anyone who goes to York. Anyone who lives in the GTA, you know where York is. That's where I go. And then what are you studying slash involved in? Um, I study children's studies. Um, for those of you that might not know, I am in school because I would like to become a teacher. Like I love hair by Shea. Hair by Shea is of course the passion, like long. But I definitely would love to be a teacher. One thing. <laughs> this is good. I haven't had a Wendy's burger in a minute, I think. Mm -mm 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 -mm. This is good. Oh. I haven't eaten like all day. So this is hitting something different. I just got one more bite, guys. One more bite. I'm hungry. Back to question after. <laughs> Next question. What do you want to do with your life? Um kind of answered it with like the school question. Um, I would love to be running here by shame to a very successful point. I would love to reach people. I love talking to people and getting them on like their healthy hair journey, talking to them about hair. So it'd be great for here by shame to get to that point. Let's try this. It looks a little This is what people do, right? Is it supposed to be chocolate? Is there a vanilla frosty? I only use that chocolate. Mm. Chili? Okay. I feel like maybe if it was a vanilla, I could do it. Chocolate. Mm. Back to the questions. Um, so yeah, I see myself running hair by shape for a very long time, hopefully, God willing. And I also would love to be a teacher, have my own classroom, really make an impact on students. That's a dream. Happy life, maybe two dogs, nice home, nice amazing partner. Um, I want to give back to my community. So yeah, all that are things I want to do with my life. Like I said, you know, just really kind of make a difference, you know, before I go. Um, 
What's your favorite thing about where you live? Is that like where I live as in like my apartment or where I live city? <clears throat> okay, we're gonna say what's my favorite thing about living in this city, I guess, or living, we'll say where I live. I guess I live downtown Toronto, so we'll say it there. My very favorite thing about living downtown Toronto is it's usually, there's my dog, it's usually, hi. <laughs> my favorite thing about living downtown Toronto is that it's close to a lot of things. Um, whenever, like, well, before the uh, virus started, if my friends wanted to do anything, it was always close to things. Um, what else? She smells food. She's really trying to get it. You have your food. Go get your food. Um, and then my favorite thing about living in my apartment, I guess, is like the space that I made for myself. Um, I love my apartment. I think it's very cute. I try my try to get it to look very nice. Um, what else? Yeah, I guess that's it. <laughs> that's it. Next question. What is your biggest fear? My biggest fear is bugs. Bugs. Specifically, my biggest fear of bugs would be um, butterflies and moths. I, if you know me, you know I'm terrified of those things. And it's really just because of their, um, sorry, I didn't mean to talk up with my mouth full. But, it's really, I'm really afraid of them just because their eyes, like their eyeballs creep me the heck out. I don't know why. Um, so yeah, really afraid of butterflies and moths. Terrible. I know everyone loves butterflies, they're so pretty, but it's no for me. Um, what's your favorite Starbucks drinks? The hot um, chai tea latte. Love that drink for anyone who's Jamaican. I love it because it reminds me of porridge, cornmeal porridge. It. What's your favorite food on the note of being Jamaican? Um, if you're Jamaican, leave like a Jamaican flag in the comments. <laughs> um, but on the note of being Jamaican, my favorite food is stew peas. Love me some stew peas. Um, with the pig's tail. If you know, you know. It's good. Um, second would be oxtail, I think. And then when it's like uh, in terms of like non-cultural dishes, my favorite food has to be like seafood pasta. I love seafood pasta. I could eat it anytime. I don't know what that was, but that I'm well, not too sure. <laughs> I can eat it all the time. Um, I also love buffalo wings. Ooh, the way to my heart. Just give me a plate of seafood pasta and buffalo wings and we're good. <laughs> Are you a good cook? I like to think I'm a good cook. I love following recipes. I love like watching videos and learning. So I think I'm a pretty good cook because I live by myself. I have to eat, right? So I cook anything I want to eat. Favorite color? My favorite color. I love purple. I've like I've always loved purple. My favorite like color for I don't know how to describe it, but like for all my workout stuff. Keep all my workout stuff is blue so i love blue it just makes me feel good helps me feel motivated when i work out so yeah i love blue my favorite place in the world has to be jamaica i've gone there so many times since i was younger love it it's literally one of my favorite like vacation spots this is supposed to be my thing i'm supposed to be eating Can you guys see that? Like why? Do you guys want some? It's really good. Yeah. Come closer. Come close. Alright. Enjoy it. Want some chili? I'll, I'll eat for you. Nah, you have to try some of those. Here. Try some. There's cheese on there. I thought you were good play. <laughs> I'm 
Okay, we have a few more questions left. How many times have you been to Disney? Zero. I would love to go to Disney. Um, maybe it'll be something that happens in the future. Who's your favorite Disney princess? So fun fact about me. Sad fact, actually. When I was growing up, I never really watched any of the Disney films. I don't know. I don't. Maybe. I really don't think it's like taken out of my memory, but I've never watched any of them. Um, I don't know why. I did love to read as a kid, so like maybe that was why I just spent all my time reading. But yeah, I never watched any of them. Um, and it's funny because my dog is like here sleeping. Her name is Nala, and that's from The Lion King. I know that. I know like the general gist of all them enough to like get me by, but like I never watched enough where I could be like I have a favorite, you know. I always tell myself I'm going to I'm going to watch them, and then it just never happens. I watched. The Lion King with um, Beyonce. <laughs> That's about it. So yeah, sorry, no favorite Disney princess. What's your favorite TV show? Hmm. I don't know, I don't really watch TV. I guess Grey's Anatomy? I don't really watch a lot of TV to be like very honest with you guys. I don't watch a lot of TV. For me, my like my ish is YouTube. I love watching YouTube. Like that's what if I'm eating a meal, if I wasn't doing this video, I would be sitting and watching a YouTube video. I love Aaliyah Space, I love Kyra on Meek, I love Amugli Tacho. Sorry if I know I didn't butcher her name. Um I love Kyla Shy, I love Bougie Barbie, I love Mocha P Beauty, I love REJ, I love who else is there? Ashley Devona, I love her. I love um Brianna Monique. I love oh, I have so many. I literally just have like my few that I watch like all the time. Um who else is there? Anna Doll. There. That's it for now. But there's like a few in there. I love. Ooh, I love Dana Alexia. Love her. Um, she's from Toronto and she's a Leo, so that's also why I love her a lot. Um, not me fangirling, but yes, I'm fangirling. I love her. She literally looks like she has such a good vibe. Um, who else is there? Hmm, I can't really think of any right now. But yeah, YouTube is my ish. Like. That's what I sit around watching all day, every day. And then, <clears throat> what's your favorite thing about YouTube? Um, my favorite thing about YouTube is like, it's a huge resource. Like, especially when I was uh, launching my business, for me, I'm just gonna you know, make sure y'all can see her. <laughs> um, for me, when I was launching my business and like, kind of like, getting things underway, I went to YouTube a lot like I was constantly searching like packaging videos and like how to run a business how to start a business like and YouTube helped me a lot like I learned a lot from YouTube now I learn more from like TikTok but yeah YouTube I love it because it's a good resource and you can literally type in anything you want to do. So last question and then we are going to do part two. Why should you subscribe to my channel and what is my channel going to be about? So why you should subscribe to my channel is that if you love hair if you love knowing things about hair that's one reason for two anyone who's on their healthy hair journey i will definitely be posting a lot of videos in regards to taking care of your natural hair getting it to its healthiest um state all that will be found on my youtube channel and then when it comes to like hair extensions because i also love a good hair extension i love a good wig so when it comes to all of that like that will also be on my youtube channel like my first video was a install video and it was like a, a, a over a year wig and i showed how to like get that up to par and how to like spruce it up so it looks nice that and like decent enough because 
um, with the everything happening with the pandemic, lace has been in such a shortage and I had a wig, but the lace was balding and the lace at the front tail was balding. Sorry, the hair on the front tail was balding. And I, my first video was how I finessed my wig to get it to look presentable, look nice. And so yeah, anything where it comes to hair, I will be posting videos. I also want to be doing, oops, sorry no. Um, I also want to be doing a lot of entrepreneur type videos because uh, as you guys know, as I mentioned, I run my own business and I would love to show people how they can run their own business and tips and things that I've learned for myself. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much why you should subscribe to my channel because it's going to be a big place to learn things. And then that also answers the question as to what my channel is going to be about. It's literally going to be kind of your one-stop shop for hair. So that's pretty much what my channel will be about. Pretty much everything hair, a little bit of entrepreneur series, which I definitely will be starting. And yeah, it's going to be fun here. I'm open to suggestions. If you guys think of anything you would love to see, just comment down below and I'll get right on it. And I hope that was a good YouTuber type tag. And thank you guys for watching. Have yourself a great night and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. See more of me. I will, I would love to get to know you guys. 